So now I'm going to show you this connections between the stringers and the cross beams. You can see this is a coped section of a I beam. To be very careful, I'll just show you the details. You can see one angle section is welded to the stringer, and on the other end, where it is joined to the cross beam, four number of bolts are provided. And on the top, it is coped. And you can see the shear studs, both on stringers as well as on the cross beams. Beneath it, beneath it, is a bottom bracing, which will be more clear from the bottom side of the bridge. And similar kind of joints are provided in all the cross beams and the stringer joints, both at the end cross beam location and definitely at the intermediate cross beam locations. So if I just show you very carefully, you can see the, this angle is welded. This angle is welded only on the web, and I don't see any connection on the bottom that is on the flange of the stringers and the cross beams. So it is pretty, pretty much clear in this video, I guess. And moving on to the next details, I'll just show you the splice zones of the bridge.